In a future conflict, even the more modernized M1 Abrams versions might not be very helpful. Not when drones and other anti-tank systems, which typically cost a fraction of what a new MBT costs, can destroy tanks willy-nilly, as the world has witnessed in the killing fields of Ukraine. The last and greatest tank battle of the 20th century is fought by the M1 Abram. One of the biggest tank engagements of the 20th century was about to begin. It has even been referred to as the last tank battle of the 20th century. Many military experts believed it might have been the last tank combat ever until the recent commencement of hostilities between Russia and Ukraine. The combat that history has dubbed the Battle of 73 Easting got its unusual moniker from the coalition troops' battle maps. That was the area that the armies of the coalition had been moving through. There, along with 4,000 infantrymen, an astounding 200-300 coalition armored vehicles of all kinds had been gathered. There were perhaps 2,500-3,000 infantrymen and 300-400 armored Iraqi vehicles on the opposing side of the combat lines. The coalition forces commanded by the United States decisively defeated the Iraqi. The Iraqi frequently didn't even realize the Yanks were approaching, and that was solely due to the fact that the Americans entered the battle with ferociously advanced Abrams tanks.